My name is Drisha Rai, I'm 16 years old and my unsung hero of science is actually two people who make quite the dynamic duo together, Howard Florey and Ernst Chain. The first time I even heard the names Florey and Chain was in one of my GCSE history lessons and before this I'd heard of penicillin, I knew what it was, I'd even learned about it in one of my biology lessons but what I didn't know which I found was a bit of a shame was that it was actually Flory and Chain who were really the main driving forces of getting penicillin out there. I'd only ever really heard of Alexander Fleming and you know that was that. I chose Flory and Chain because not many people especially my age know about these men but everyone knows about penicillin. Flory and Chain aren't that well known because of most people's tendency to just focus on who invented this or who discovered that and a lot of the time the process of you know getting that thing out there is not really thought about. Another reason I think that um, I explored in history actually is that Alexander Fleming had a lot of people who were kind of backing him up and who really wanted to champion him. My favourite fact that I learned while making this video is actually really sad and it's mentioned in the video. It's that Flurry and Chain were able to help Albert Alexander, a volunteer, um, to recover from his septicemia with the help of penicillin but then eventually the stock runs out and they were both so desperate to keep him alive that they even like extracted penicillin from his urine that you know hadn't been used and I find it really sad it's very heartbreaking because it shows that they were really putting all their heart and soul into this and they were doing it for people